Hey everyone, it's LaDon. I hope you're doing well. Um, just got up not long ago, so pardon my voice. Kind of like, you know, I'm not a morning person. So, in any event, I wanted to come on here and show you day three hair um, using the conditioner by Paul Mitchell as my leave-in and, of course, the uh, flaxseed gel that I make that's infused with basil and um, rosemary and mint. So um, last night I did the same thing I did the previous night, which was I missed it my hair. You know what? I think I forgot to miss my hair before I went to sleep. I did not miss my hair. Um, so I just went to sleep. I went to sleep on a satin pillowcase. I slept good, y'all. <laughs> I slept rough. <laughs> but I uh, got up this morning. I missed it my hair to kind of wake the curls up and, you know, add a little moisture to my hair. And um, and so these are the results. I'm just going to lean in so you can see. And what I'm also going to do is show you, because I have a little spot right here. You can see that. See where the curls have kind of come unclumped. And it looks, I don't know, a little bit frizzy. It's not bad. But I'm going to show you how I um, really easily do um, a, a repair. To this area or just refresh this um, takes like 60 seconds but as you can see the curls are still really nicely clumped together they're still very soft um, have great hang still on the hair up here up top it is um, it's still very soft and I have definition but it's interesting because the curls are not necessarily clumped together. And normally I don't like that effect. Um, but I like it with this gel and, and with, you know, I don't know if it's the gel or if it's the leave-in with the gel, but I really like that look with, um, uh, or, or that effect that's created with that particular combination. It works. Um, so I'm pleased with the hair. But I'm going to show you what I do to areas like this where it had, you know, gotten a little loosened, kind of frizzy. So I take my water bottle, or if you're in the bathroom, you could just put your fingers under your water faucet. But I just squirt a little water um, so that my, my fingers are wet. And then I just take that section and I run my fingers up and down the section like that. Usually I have more water on my fingers. Apply a little more water because I'm not I'm doing this here. And sometimes I'll even like comb my fingers, you know, through the section and then I'll just kind of twist it and then the girl the curls begin to kind of form once again. Okay, and then that's gonna dry and it'll dry similar to this other side. If you have areas where you maybe have frizz or the curl, you know, got flat and it hasn't perked back up, you can just, you know, run your fingers under some water or just even take your spray bottle and spray that specific, you know, those, um, that section or those, uh, that set of strands and then just run your finger over it, you know, maybe comb your fingers through those hairs and you can wind them around your finger if you want. Sometimes I just comb through it and then just let it kind of pop back, scrunch it a bit, and then let it air dry. And um, it dries very nicely. So as you can see, it's starting to curl up again. And it's nicely clumped. So that's what I do to, um, you know, to, to my hair when I have those situations or situations arise. So I hope this was helpful. Um, again, love the hair, love that gel combination. What is this hair doing? Oh, okay. <laughs> uh, love the hair, love that combination, and I'm just so pleased with it. So, um, I will see you guys in the next video. Talk to you soon. Bye.